Hello friends, this is Dr. Sangeeta Joshi from Vidyalankar Institute of Technology, Mumbai. Currently, we are studying the course Fundamentals of Logic Circuits. It's a lab course. In the earlier video, we have seen how to install LTSpice. Now, let us understand how to implement a simple Boolean expression using the LTSpice. Supposing we have a Boolean expression f is equal to a plus b into c. So, what is the first step? You have to open the LTSpice. Then go to the file tab and then open the schematic editor. In the schematic editor, you uh, now what you require a plus b means you require or, or gate and into c that means you require an and gate. So open a uh, go, open uh, go to the component tab, open the uh, or click on the or gate. We are using the 74 series, so 7432 or gate. Then again select the and gate 7408. Then give the labels a, b, c. Uh, for the inputs, these are the three inputs. Output is the f is equal to a plus b into c. The next step is that uh, you add the labels for the uh, step two is the add voltage sources for three inputs because we are using the three inputs for therefore we are using the three voltage sources rather than wiring from each voltage source to the each input separately. What I have done, I have labeled here a, b, c and the same labels I have given here for the respective voltage sources. Now, rather than giving the A as a 0 or 1 or 5 volt and 0 ground, uh, what I have done, I am given, giving the, the, it as a pulse. Because whenever you are giving the pulse with different timings or frequencies, then all possible combinations of the ABC, 3 inputs, that is 8 possible combinations can be covered. So, I have given here the timing as a 2 or time on as a 2 micro second and 4 microsecond as a total period. So, here 4 microsecond and 8 microsecond, here 8 microsecond and 16 microsecond. So, that is how I am actually giving the voltage source. Add labels for the connected that I have already told. A here, A here, B here, B here. And uh, F out is to be de uh, defined as an output port and uh, I have given that label as a function output. The next step is that uh, step 5, you include the 74HCT.lib file using the dot edit option and under the edit option, there is a dot op spice directive. Also, I will also demonstrate you all these things. And then how much time you would like to have analysis and what type of analysis. So, define analysis type and time. So, it is a transient analysis and my uh, final cycle for the C input is the 16 microseconds. That is the one cycle. So, I am taking this as a 16 microsecond. And finally, you can add the comments. You can write your name on your schematic. And you can uh, uh, write the title of the experiment, uh, what tutorial you are using or lab you are doing. Implement Boolean expression f is equal to a plus b into c using LTSpice. Now, then you run the simulator and verify the results of the Boolean expression. You will find that the results are f is equal to uh, now a plus b into c this boolean expression was there and a b and c are the three inputs we have taken uh, two microsecond as a t on and total cycle as a four microsecond for a second cycle we have taken it for the eight microsecond for the b input and for the c input the total cycle was 16 microsecond and we have also observed the output for 16 microsecond this is the f out now as long as the c input since it is a product of this summation and the c input as long as the C input is 0, that product would be 0. So, C input is 0 till this point, that is 8 microseconds. So, till 8 microseconds, I am getting the output as a 0. Thereafter, 0 plus 0. Uh, so, A is 0, B is 0. So, my summation is 0. So, even if my C is 1, actually it is this summation is 0, that is how I am getting the output as a 0. And for the rest of the time, either of the inputs is 1, so A and B. So, 0 plus 1 is 1 and into 1. 0 plus 1 is 1 into 1 and 1 plus 0, 1 plus 1 that is 1 and into 1. So, the rest of the time I am getting the output as a 1. Now, let us try to understand whatever we have seen uh, using the LTSpice, how we can demonstrate. So, I will open a new schematic for you. So, I have opened the new schematic. Uh, let us start with the components. I am choosing the 7432 OR gate for A plus B part and I am choosing the AND gate for the into C part. So, 0, 8 is the AND gate. So, this AND gate I have chosen. Then let us do the connections. 
So I'm connecting the output of this to this. I'm extending this. So you can see here. And the output is, this is the output. Okay, so let us label A. I have defined it as under the NUR. I neither input nor it output. So since I have copied A everywhere, I'll have to now ch change here to B. I'll have to now change here to C. Okay. And uh, here I can write under the comment, uh, edit, you can say here the, or spice directives comment f is equal to a plus b into c so you can write or you can make its font like slightly f is equal to a plus b into c okay so Font you can see one. Okay, so this is done. Then now we can have a output f out, which I had shown you f out. But of course, this is to be uh, defined as an output port. So this is the output f out. So I am connecting it here. Okay, now I'll have to shift it slightly up. Now I will define the voltage sources. So voltage, I am connect. Okay. So rather than copying right away, what I will do, I will make complete pulse and everything for one. Then ground it. Ground. Label. A. Okay. Now pulse. Go to advanced. Select pulse. Initial value is 5 volt, then I am giving 0 volt, 1 pico, delay 1 rise, uh, delay 0, rise time is 1 pico, fall time is 1 pico, and uh, T on is, suppose I have micro, this is in example I had taken 2 micro, so let us 4 micro, double of that, ok. Make it right click. So font slightly less vertical. Okay. Shift it to here. Okay. Now you go to edit and duplicate. So you need not define again the pulse and everything. So this is. Edit. Duplicate. Okay, this is extra copying. Okay, change this to B. Okay, change this to C. Okay, change this timing to 4. Leave space 8. Okay, and this is. 8 and 16. So my now timings and everything is defined. Now what is remaining is the include. So edit dot spice include because we are using the 74 series. So include 74 hct dot lib file. Okay. So I am putting it here. Then for how much time you would like to do the simulation. So I would like to have it for 16 microseconds. So I am doing it 16 microseconds. Okay. Now comment is required. So dot o. So comment. You can write your name. Sangeeta Zoshi. Writing my name here. You can again have another comment. Comment. Implementation of. Boolean expression f is equal to a plus b into c 
okay so all everything is done now save your file okay then run missing gain value f is equal to so we are not uh, Okay. So, well, friends, uh, now we are ready with the schematic uh, and everything. Uh, title, comments, everything is done. Now, let us go for the this thing. I'll... So let us run this and uh, I have already run it so the waveforms are available. Now you can see here uh, as long as C is 0 everything would be 0 because our expression is product of C into A plus B. So whatever is A plus B whenever C is 0 output is 0 and whenever c is 1 here both are 0 so product sum is 0 so 0 into anything is 0 so we are getting here the output as a 0 rest of the time either of the inputs is 1 a and b so sum is 1 and anyway c is also 1 so rest of the c part is 1 so therefore you are getting the output as a 1 thank you